33 years out here. Oh, you lived here for 33 years? Yeah. Oh. You from Florida? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm, I'm actually from Massachusetts, but I'm in Florida. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I like it here. It's not this as hot as like, Florida. Yeah, Are you a Catholic? I am Catholic. Yes. I'm not a devote, really, but I do. I go we were, My ancestors were um, Lutheran. Um, anybody asks us to leave, we've been kicked out of better places. <laughs> the Lutherans had it really tough. I'll tell you where to look for the history. History of Lenore County it was at the archives at ECU. It's Which isn't a, very far from there. It's just right down there. I'm it, almost positive. It's a black book with uh, gold uh, medallion on the front. And it's at the library? Uh-huh. And they tell about the history of um, the graphing read. Yeah. And um, Luther. Luther and the de graphing. They had a warm welcome. The Native Americans tied them to a stake and burned them. Oh my goodness. And that's not good. The original artwork was in, um, I think, Switzerland or Sweden. Really? Yeah, it's been many years. I, I got, I got so upset by the history I couldn't get into it because it was my relative, well, my yeah. ancestor. Yeah. My father's name was Luther. Yeah. Oh no. Okay. You ever go to St. Gabe's? I, this is our first time in town. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But we might be here for a few days. You going to school? I've already went to school. Graduated. I went to college. I got my bachelor's in English. That's good. But I don't really do very much with my major. But. Uh, Mr. Kyle, who lives on the other road, uh, he's the best friend of my husband. Uh, he used to work at Circuit City. I can't think of the name. It starts with C-O-N something. It's to do with computers. But Mr. Kyle lives... You know where Mr. Lee lives? Don Lee? No, like I said, we just got here a couple My hours ago. My brought husband bought the property from him. And uh, Mr. Lee owns Lee's Country Kitchen. Oh, wait, wait. Did we see that on the way in? Lee's Country Kitchen. It's the yeah. big old gas station. Is that what that is? I don't know. I've been up there once in 33 years, maybe twice. I, my husband did business with him. I don't do business with him. I don't know him that way. Um, Richard Kyle worked at Circuit City. He's a good friend of my husband. He's into electronics. He graduated from Columbia University which is where my husband went after he got out of military in World War II. What, did, what was he in the military for? 1943, he was in Morocco, and uh, he was a driver, and he was a diplomat. He speaks six different languages. Oh, wow. I have trouble with the English. <laughs> As do I. <laughs> um, if you check the newspaper and the news you'll find out that some young black people were doing what you call it exorcisms and they did one on hey, a little black on? kid and he died and they went to like jail. Like voodoo stuff? Like I don't crazy know what witchcraft? It was. Like they broke into our house and practiced on me before they did it to him. Somehow I survived. I don't know how. Say what? Yeah. They, that is... In the middle Unreal. of the night, intruders in the house. So was there any justice served? Or like, was this just... The like, kid died. They went but to did, jail. Did, oh, they, the person went to jail. Did, the NAACP is after them big yeah, time yeah, now yeah. for what they were doing. Um, so I've noticed there's a lot of jigs around here. There's a lot of black uh, people, yeah. They're black people. There's a lot. They, don't call there, them names. Is there is there a lot of this exorcism stuff going on around here? I don't yeah. know. I it, it's something that happened to us it's because we were vulnerable. It's, you know, it's, and all we want to be is good church going people. You know. Yeah, they're black folks, and they're they have a different perspective on life than most people. Yeah. Really, 
It's cray. No, it's not tragic. I survived. The kid was no longer suffering. He had issues with his health. I think he was, um, what, um, what you call it, epileptic or oh something like that. Well, he didn't stand a chance. And, you know, is, it's so, is, what time frame was, did you think this would this happen? Is this stuff still going today? Because I really, I, I really would like to. Well, I know home invasions do happen. You ever happen, hear of Paris Hilton? I, yes, I know I've this, but, but I mean, I'm... Um, Her I'm, home was invaded, and was, they stole stuff, and it was three months before she realized... I was thinking more about it. more about the exorcist stuff. Do you, oh, is there, is that just some mumbo-jumbo, or do you think it was real, or...? Uh, they were in our house. My husband don't believe me. I'm, I'm not going to waste time trying to convince him. I called my sister and told her what happened. She believed me. She said there's a lot of stuff going on in Greenville. Her daughter went to college here. If I had a kid in school, it would not be in Greenville. Uh -uh. So you think there's been like a lot of paranormal activity around here? Murder in, from uh, murder on the campus, uh, home invasion on the campus. Uh, and you, this little, like, does this stuff happen in little Greenville all the time? Or? It's unusually violent crimes being, uh, That's what Eric was saying. Yeah. It's really tragic. Yeah. It's, it's sort of like the Boston like player, right? bombings, you know? Yeah, it's you like, why, what, what would possess people to do that, you know? It's really... Meanness, I think. Revenge. Religious differences. I can't see that much difference in the religions. I, I haven't studied it a lot, but Muhammad is... Um, they're warriors. 